We've all done it and many of us are still doing it though these days, the arrival of the internet and its associated social media platforms and apps has heralded a huge change in our dating behaviour. But Netflix's new near future drama Osmosis, the streaming juggernaut's third French original series, edges into fantasy sci-fi and presents a quite different attempt at tapping into the dating zeitgeist. Conceived by Audrey Fouché, the writer at the centre of the brilliant French series Les Revenants, Osmosis is set in a slightly futuristic France and follows several young Parisians who sign up to an experimental dating program that looks to pair up soulmates using artificial intelligence. Paul and Esther, played by Hugo Becker and Agatha Bonitza, respectively, are the brother and sister team behind this new technology, from which the series takes its name, designed to create the perfect match for those looking for love. With the technology in test mode, the series initially follows 12 volunteers as they're introduced to their scientifically identified true loves. But the experiment has its challenges having split public opinion and faces immediate problems with medical ethics committees. It's an entertaining and engrossing first episode, a trip well worth taking as the story breaks into several strands. Graham, I found this a bit puerile. I found, oh, I thought, this is not a series for me and I don't know whether it's the age thing, but you know, there, I, I found it melodramatic, you know, sort of like unbelievably melodramatic. Um, you know, you've, it's just, I don't know, I just don't, didn't no, get it's it. No, not, it's not a great series, uh, but I, I thought it was pretty interesting and I liked the look of it. I thought it was quite cleverly uh, put together and uh, I thought the way that they manipulate the storylines was, was quite clever enough, I thought, to make you want to follow it to see where it goes and see how those 12 uh, guinea pigs really react to, to what's about to happen to them. Well, I, I mean, the only interesting thing for me is that uh, rather plump girl who's one of the volunteers... Ah, yes, there's something lurking there. Well, but who would know? I mean... What they do is have this thing in their brain that draws the social network throughout the ether world to find their perfect match. Oh, please. It's sort of like I am so uninterested in this. I mean, I am opting out now. I don't care what the rather plump girl does. <laughs> Look, you know, I'd give this three stars. I'll hang in with it. It's not great, but I'll, I'll give it three and a half.